Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Today's session, I am going to teach about very basic topic in very large HDR. So, how to express the number? So, here we deal about the different type of number systems. How to represent the number system inside the program? So, first I write the syntax so far. How to express the number system? So, let me write the syntax. Yan tick b x x so this n represent numbers so how many bit we can use inside the program so this b represent base so base value for the number system so we can classify and the base is four types first one is binary so this binary represent in the letter b then second one octal so this octal represent a letter o next one decimal so this represent small d next one hexadecimal this represent small h so this b represent base of number system so in this very log hdl we can use this four number systems binary number system it represent small b octal number system it represent small o decimal it represent small d hexadecimal it represent small h then this 2x this 2x represent number of bits number of bits so this bits are like 0 1 don't care and z so 0 and 1 already we familiar and x is represent don't care value so this rep is that represent high impedance state so these four numbers are used inside the bits now i clearly explain how to represent the binary numbers in very large sphere octal decimal and hexadecimal we will discuss one by one let me take binary so first one is binary so very long term one stored numbers stored numbers so first let me take binary so n represent numbers let me take here one so one big value one tick it's a binary number system i can use b so this xx represent number of bits the number of bit represent based on this number n so here I write 0. So stored number is 0. It's a 1 bit values. Suppose I need to represent the 4 bit values in binary. So 4 tick B 0 1 0 1. The stored number is 0 1 0 1. So it's a stored number. Suppose I need to express 8 bit number A T B 0 0 0 1 1 X 1 Z. So likewise also you can represent the 8 bit numbers. So stored number is 0 0 0 1 1 X 1 Z. So likewise you can represent the binary numbers. Then we go for octal. So next one is octal. I need to represent 8 bit values so a tick o so this o represent octal so this value let me take the value 1 2 so 1 2 is the value the stored number is let me write from lsb 2 0 1 0 2 0 0 1 1 then 0 0 totally it's a 8 bit so likewise you represent the octal number system 
then we go to decimal. So how to express the decimal number system in very of code. So 4 pick B, sorry, 4 pick D, 5. So this D represent decimal number, this 4 represent 4 bit values. So this 5 is represent in a 4 bit values. So stored number 0, 1, 0, 1. So it's a decimal representation. Then we go for hexadecimal. So hexadecimal value, let me take 4 pick small h 7. So the stored number is 0, 1, 1, 1. So it's a 4 bit hexadecimal value. Suppose I need to express the hexadecimal number in 12 bit. So let me write here 12, tick H, then I mentioned the hexadecimal value A, B, C. So the stored number for this A, B, C is A value 1010, one, B is 1011, one, C value 1100. One, so it's totally 12 bit. So likewise, you express the numbers in Verilog HDL code. So it's a very basic topic. If you are familiar with this concept, you can express the number inside the program very easy manner. So thanks for watching my channel. If you are watching first time in my video, kindly subscribe and support us to make a lot of videos.